Hey everyone, my name is Master Stuff, and welcome back to the Norx SMP. In today's episode, we are going to be starting off enchanting our gear because we hit level 30. And in between episodes, I have found a mob spawner, so that's why I'm at level 30. I think I'm going to risk a uh, unbreaking tree. Efficiency 4, that, that is actually amazing. Would have preferred fortune, but um, that's that's still good actually. So we can mine blocks really quickly. I'm just going to check what I can get on my armor and other tools. If we can get sharpness, fire aspect. Yeah, we'll take it. And we can repair the sword if we need to. Um, let's see. I know I can't really do a level in, uh, 30 enchant. But silk touch is a good shout. We might get that as well. But I don't know. I want to see what I can get on my armor. Because what we need is protection for. Because what I heard is that we will be fighting the Ender Dragon soon. But right now, we'll go to the shopping district. Okay, so my plan today is to do my first shop. Well, in this realm, I guess. So, what I plan to do is do a tiny little market. Not too tiny, but like, yeah, just a sm small enough market, basically. And this market will sell just random things, I guess. It's not really a serious shop, really. It's just going to sell random things at random times. So it's a basically just a very simple build. I messed it up already. <laughs> I say it's simple and I already messed up the pattern. Okay, let's start again. We need, um, what is it called? Stairs all the way along here. So this will be the counter. And then we'll get a bunch of slabs to hold up the roof. And I think the first items in this shop that I will be building is bones and arrows. And I think I'll probably get put in some obsidian as well because I have a good bit of obsidian. That I, w I was going to sell it eventually so I might as well sell it in the master market. Which is what I'm going to be calling this market. I don't think I said that. But anyway, what? Oh, I missed that slab up. So I think the pricing will be like... A diamond per like 32 uh, bones and then a stack of arrows will be one diamond and then obsidian will be a diamond for like 10 obsidian I think it's a fair p price really cuz like it's like if you don't want to spend all the time getting obsidian you know you can sacrifice one diamond for like 10 which I think is pretty a good deal if I'm gonna be honest so what we need to do is break this, then place that there, break that, okay. See that's looking good already, but right now we need to place, oh no I can't place it there, okay. So I'll just place it there for now, this is very temporary. And what we need to do is build up tree, no actually, too high, because I'm going to put wool there. So it kind of looks like a tent almost, on top, so we'll put that, nope. That's wrong. Yeah, we need to... Yeah, that's the right height, actually. I think... Yeah, I'm going to change this because it doesn't look that too appealing right now. Let's put that there. Go one, two. That's looking real good. Yeah, I like this. So I got my wool out. Uh, the pattern is going to be just green and white. Because as of now, I don't have a stable sheep farm all i really do with animals now is like i just find random animals and i just shear them and then i just kill them as well for meat and stuff because i did uh when i started the series i uh, like in this new realm i didn't focus on farms i just went straight into building my base because i wanted to continue off like straight away and get it out as soon as i can for you guys so yeah this is what uh, yeah this will be the sides. So it's just basically a mirror kind of thing. So it'll be on the same on each side, but not really. Like, the front isn't going to be the same as the left and right side. But it's going to be the same as the back. And the left and right sides are going to be the same. So we'll put that there. There. Yeah, like this. Okay, so I got basically all of it done right now. I think all I need to do is put uh, chests and barrels in here. 
Well, actually, I'm going to put a uh, more poles on this. So it looks kind of more grounded, I guess. Oh, yeah, that look that's looking real nice. Yeah, I like that. Let's put that there. Yeah, so all I need to do now is stock the market. And then maybe add a few details as well. But I want to do something with this roof. I think it kind of looks a tiny bit weird. I don't know. Like the way it transitions into a log and then wool. That's not really like. I don't really. I don't know. We'll see what, ha what it looks like when I put slabs down. So let's sleep real quick. Um, okay. So let's break this. Put it in the corner so it's out of the way. See, it looks really good because the back kind of looks like a shelf, kind of. But we'll have like a table with chests and barrels and stuff like at the back. So, does this look good? Wait, we'll see. What's... Oh, uh, no, okay. I can't do that. Okay, I was going to replace it with a log. But that's not going to work. Um, does this look good? No, actually, no, break that. Doesn't looking right. So what I'll do now is make a tiny table right here, and then we'll put like chests as well and a barrel. So we'll make two chests. Put that there. So where shall we place? It? I think yeah, we'll just place it like that. And hmm, now maybe on the other side, maybe. Yeah, we'll just make a tiny table here first. Yeah, that that looks good. Now, what we need to do is make a barrel. And... There. That looks amazing. All we need to do now is get more bones and arrows. Okay, so this is the spawner that I found. It's actually pretty good. It gets a lot of XP and a bunch of skeletons real fast. It's also a great source for bones, arrows, uh, enchanted gear as well. Like, I found some really good bows. Obviously, like, the armor isn't great. So, we are back at the Master Market. As you can see, I put down a bunch of signs saying the prices and what's in them. And um, we'll put all the bones in here. 64 arrows for a diamond. Oh, uh, no. That's my diamond pickaxe. Put that in there all this in here and then 10 obsidian i think i'm gonna change that because you know it took me a long time to get this obsidian so we'll do it 10 obsidian equals two diamonds you know two diamonds can make a difference you know this is like our premium item for today so put all that in there that's great but I think that's going to be the end of this video here, guys. I hope you all did enjoy. Please do subscribe and share with a friend who might also like this series. There is a lot more to come to this season, so I'll see you guys later.